Hello everybody, welcome back to another video, and in this video I'm going to tell you about the latest Minecraft 1.20 news. So if you like Minecraft videos like this one, then please make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more Minecraft 1.20 videos in the future. And so recently the mobs were revealed for the Minecraft mob vote. We'll be able to vote on either the Sniffer, the Rascal or the Tough Golem during Minecraft Live 2022, which will happen on October 15th less than a week from now and so i've made a video on these three mods with more information if you want to watch that link to it will be in the top right of your screen and i've also created a poll on my channel where i wanted to see what people are currently thinking what they will be voting on during minecraft live and a vast majority of people seem to be going to vote for the sniffer during the event and so unlike in previous years where the competition is being pretty close between for example the glow squid and the isolager and the LA and the copper golem this year it doesn't seem like it's going to be very close but maybe something massive changes in the coming week and people suddenly start voting for the rascal or the tough golem i'm not sure but honestly any new mob in the game is already a great addition. But as for today, I wanted to show you the updated launcher and also the Minecraft Live website because some things have been changing. So let's first head over to the Minecraft launcher to see what's going on there. All right, so here we are in the Minecraft launcher. And so usually there are only the four options on this bar on the left. We have Minecraft Java Edition, Minecraft Bedrock Edition or Minecraft for Windows, Minecraft Dungeons and of course recently added Minecraft Legends which has not come out yet but will come out next year but the button is already here you can switch to it and watch the trailer and stuff like that but recently Minecraft Live has been added to the Minecraft launcher and if we click on it we get this page over here so we actually see the set from last year's Minecraft Live. I assume this will be updated once we get to the actual Minecraft Live. We can see down here, vote in five days. So most likely this button will be clickable in five days and there you can vote on the next mob to be added into the game. But I'll be making a video on how to vote when that is possible as well. And so just remember that you will be able to vote 24 hours before the stream starts in this Minecraft launcher on a better condition server or on the official minecraft.net website. That is all possible. We also see this message on the right over here, mob vote 2022, vote for a new mob. And you can also vote by playing in the special carnival map in better condition. Vote opens in five days, five hours and 40 minutes. And you can watch for more details, which actually brings you to the Minecraft Live live stream which doesn't really help for more details currently so i don't know why that's there and so below this there's some information on minecraft live with what i just said you can vote on launcher minecraft.net or on the carnival map in better condition and on the bottom here we have a little bit of information on the three mobs so we have the sniffer this ancient creature was once part of the overworld ecosystem now you can bring back the extinct if you find its egg hatch new mobs breed them and figure out how to make the extinct thrive once more there are seeds out there that only the sniffer can find and so the interesting thing here is that if you hover over the image of the sniffer it starts to shake for some reason i'm not quite sure why but that's pretty cool you can't click on it or anything it just moves around if you hover your mouse over it similar thing with the rascal over here some information on the rascal Rascal, mischievous mob that loves to play and hide and seek. Rascal lurks in the underground mines, waiting to be found. If you spot the same rascal three times, it will reward you with a prize to keep your eyes open. And finally, the tough golem, yes, definitely shaking as well. A statue with a twist, it comes alive. When the tough golem awakens, it will walk around, pick up and hold any item it comes across. Don't worry, it will return to the same spot if you placed it in. When it turns back into a statue, it may be a work of art, but you're the designer. And so these texts are basically the same text we saw in the Minecraft.net articles I also showed you in the previous video. And so most likely this page on the Minecraft launcher will be updated once you're able to vote on mobs. And then probably once again when the Minecraft livestream actually starts. And if we head over to Minecraft.net, the website itself, we get a little bit more information here. So here we can see mob vote 2022 is coming, which mob will join Minecraft. The vote opens in, again, five days, five hours and 36 minutes. And we get the same information as we saw in the launcher with what Minecraft Live is, the three different mobs, the information on there. But then there is an extra part down here with a little FAQ. And so if you have any more questions, most of them are probably answered here. But what I find interesting here is a couple of details. So for example, you get one vote for the mob vote. Of course, it makes sense. However, you can change it as many times as you want during the 24 hours before the stream starts and only your final vote counts. And so you can't vote on Twitter anymore. 
And so this is also an important part, I believe. So here it mentions, how do you vote in Minecraft Battle Conditions? So you have to make sure that you have the latest version of Minecraft Battle Condition on your device. Then just launch the game and click the Minecraft Live button you'll see on the bottom left on the main menu screen. So this is similar to what we saw before, where they did a test run for this voting process. You got an extra button on the bottom left, as you can see here. You can click on it and then join a special Battle Condition server where you could vote on either the Wither or the Iron Dragon here. But now, of course, you'll be able to vote on the Rascal, Sniffer, or Tough Golem. And so there's also a little bit more information on this server as well. So it says this carnival-themed multiplayer map is a special live event for players around the world to vote their favorite mob together. When you've decided which mob you want to join Minecraft, pull its lever to cast your vote. Besides voting and exploring the carnival with fellow Minecraft players, there are also lots of mini games to play. And so it does say down here, check out this trailer for a preview of the Minecraft Live 2022 map. However, if you click on it, you can just get to the mob vote trailer. That's a bit strange, but maybe this will be updated in the future. And again, if you don't have better condition, you can also vote in the Minecraft launcher and also on this website. And so there we go. Those are the updates to the launcher and the Minecraft.net website with some more information on the voting process. As I mentioned before, I'll upload a dedicated how to vote video on Friday once we're actually able to vote to show you how this all works. And so if you liked this video, then please make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more Minecraft 1.20 related videos in the future. I want to thank my tier 3 member, the Smiglar. Thank you so much for becoming a tier 3 member. But there we go. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope to see you all in the next one. So till then, bye-bye. Mm -hmm.